All right, so one thing when we're building our roller coaster, we want to do is use the trailer advantage. So I've already talked about the two aspects of this, and the first one is using the natural slope of the property to extend the ride. So right now I've got the hill up on the high side of the hill. So as you come down, you don't uh, get too much speed, but you do gain another uh, two, maybe three feet as you go down the hill. All right. So right now we're looking at, uh, right in the left hand side of this, uh, you can see that the first hill, and we did the second thing of using our terrain, and that is we went right through the underbrush of a uh, gum tree. Yes, we go. And uh, now we're coming towards uh, this giant tree right here. Now obviously I'm not gonna cut it down because that would be a waste of uh, uh, money, and there's no reason for it to cut down. But I do, did notice that uh, when I started laying out the, the pipes here, I want a negative G-delf here. And that, that means uh, you're going to actually be thrown over your seat. And I noticed that these tracks kind of naturally uh, started leaning this way, which I think would be a cool thing. So as you're coming up here and you're going to get thrown out, I want, I want people to think that they're getting thrown out in this giant tree right here. And then it moves around and comes to the side. All right, so what I'm actually going to do is extend uh, cut the pipes uh, along and parallel to the ground and actually bring them out another six feet so that this hill will crest uh, right about four feet from the tree. So yeah, about six feet uh, from where, where we are now. Uh, make you think that we're going this way and then bring you back down right at the tree. And then we're going to go into a small tip where you get some cheese down go right back up into another negative video. So I think this is going to be one of the coolest parts of the ride uh, because of the uh, near miss. So we're going to get started. Uh... Hey parents, are you tired of your kids spending way too much time in front of a computer doing nothing? Why don't you get them outside and build a giant awesome roller coaster with them? Hey, it's a great opportunity to bond with your kids and teach them about building stuff and stuff they're just not going to learn in school. So come on out to mentoredengineer.com slash rollercoaster and I will show you step by step how to do this and avoid major pitfalls. And you'll get screams of delight just like this one. <laughs>